Welcome to Shinshu International School. Our school is located in a downtown area. It's set back away from the road. And let me take you on a little tour of our school. This is our new building. It was just built this past year. We moved into it on September 3rd. So, it's a brand new campus, brand new program. It's a very exciting time for HIS. Here's our basketball courts. It just got done raining today, so you can see there's some water on it still. A lot of our kids like to hang out down here. You can see them hanging out down here by the basketball courts. We've got wireless outside also, so a lot of kids will bring their laptop computers outside and work on them. Here's a little mini amphitheater type area where kids like to hang out and rest. Sometimes sleep if they're tired. Full security all around the campus. This is our art room right here. Our pond with our fishes. A little bit. Let me start this by taking you into the art room. This first room right here is the art room. You can see it's a little bit empty. Walk across a little bridge here to get in there. This room right here is waiting to be developed. This is where our art room will be. We do have some art going on right now. Some kids working on a few projects. So the person coming in to work in our art program, this will be the space that is yours to design, to grow, to develop into the art program that we hope it can be. We've got a little walk on balcony right here. This is the art room. Let me take you upstairs. I'll take you up floor by floor. I'll walk you past the office first. Here's the Whoa! Ha -ha! ESL room right there. We got the accounting office. We got the secondary administration Bye -bye. office right here. Bye bye. Grant Bruskovich, you're going to meet him at the fair. Hello. Here is the secondary office. There's Laura, you met her downstairs earlier. We've got Laura in here. Rick Pierce, who's an outside consultant coming in. We've got Catherine sitting right here. She's not here right now. This is Grant's office right there. This is my office right here. And this is Mr. Ken Willis. Right here. Hi, hey Ken. Greetings, Al. One and all. Director of Student and Family Support. Here we're heading down to the cafeteria. The cafeteria is downstairs. The school is equipped with an elevator right here. Here's Laura. Hi, Laura. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Here is the cafeteria. cooking. We have the kitchen back here. And here is the school. This is most of our student body, but not all of it. How's the food? These are some of our music rooms. This right here is Studio One. Studio Two. And this in here is Studio Three. You can't see in there. So we've got three music studios here. This is our auditorium. Here's another one of our musicians.
Hey Kevin. store our cars and our scooters. Hi ladies. Oh the bathrooms for the elementary. Here you have the courtyard playground area for the elementary. You can see there is been a little bit of rain here, so it's a little bit wet back here. Here's the play area for our students, one of the play areas anyway. Upstairs. We're walking up to the first floor. Here are the student lockers. How are you? This is a typical locker, nice and big. Here's the first floor here. Hey! This is one of our teachers, Thomas, and another student, Jack, working on his laptop. These areas right here are going to be student lounge spaces. Some of our elementary students. So these areas right here are going to be developed into student lounges. Let me take you into a classroom to show you what a typical classroom is like. Projector, a screen, and a 20 inch iMac, and a sound system. Each room has one of these projectors in it, an iMac, screen, Sound system. It's another one of our students. Hey, Cindy, how are you? Uh. And you can get a feel. Of so here we're going up to the third floor. The lockers on each floor are different colors. Here we have more students working on laptops. English is taught up here. Here's a nice overview of outside with the basketball area. Up to the fourth floor now. This right here will be actually developed into a student lounge area once again. The students right now are currently designing these spaces themselves. They raised the money themselves and they're going to figure out exactly what they want to do with these spaces right here. Each floor, the lounge will be a little bit different from the other floors. Here's one of the labs. Here's Paul Moreau again in his lab. This is our dry lab. This is our other lab. This is supposedly our wet lab. These are our fume hoods. Same thing, you got your iMac, you got your projector, and this is on the fourth floor. You've got the fume hoods. This, this space right here will be developed at one point into a greenhouse. Um, with the natural light up here. That's another phase of our development of the building.
Lastly, going up to the very top floor, we have got our library. It's a, it's a great space. We use this right here for all school gatherings. Um, we actually meet up here quite a bit. This area right here will be our future library. We plan to start building it this upcoming year. This is the top floor, fifth floor. Work area right here where we have a couple computers, but I don't think they get used that much. We've got the photocopy machine, plus we've got textbooks and other resources. Yeah. This right here is heading out to the outside behind the school. This is a playground for a lot of elementary students. Hello! Hello. Oh, this is where a lot of students play. Right back here is a public track, and this is what we use quite a bit for our wellness program. So a lot of our students actually, what they do is they exit through down here, and they use the track in the back. I'll walk you back there. This is a track and field that we have access to behind our school. You can still see, you can see it's been raining a lot here lately with a few basketball courts that aren't very nice. We use this area out here for field hockey, uh, rugby sometimes, soccer, and you can see this is directly behind the back of our school. Thank you for watching our school tour. We're a small school, but we're a small school with large aspirations. If you want to come be part of helping to build one of the most innovative programs in Asia, then HIS might be the place for you. We look forward to seeing you at the UNI Job Fair. See you soon.